This is Dental All-Stars, where we bring you the best in dentistry on marketing, management, and training. Hi, I'm Shelly Van Epps, the VP of Business Growth and Development and a Mastery Coach here at All-Star Dental Academy. And today I want to talk with you about controlling our chaos. I am certain that on many occasions you've walked into your practice in the morning and looked at the schedule and made a decision. You've either decided today is going to be a great day or, oh my goodness, today is going to be pure chaos. And I'm here to tell you you're right. No matter what decision that you've made heading into that day, whether you're the doctor or a team member, that's what you're going to end up with. You're going to either have a great day or you're going to have a chaotic day. The difference is determining what constitutes a great day or a chaotic day. So when I'm working with a team, what we need to do is step back and first ask each other, what are you looking for in a given day? Is it all about the production and what we end with at the end of the day on the numbers standpoint? Is it about the number of patients that we're seeing? Is it about not having any holes? not seeing any moments where there's not a patient in the chair? Or is it about minimizing the number of patients, but yet producing certain numbers? Is it more so about the type of treatment that we're looking to complete that day? So when you're, when you're doing this and you're establishing what constitutes a good day, make sure you're very clear with your team. Team, be clear with the doctor on what you feel is a good day so that you understand one another and you're not at the end of the day saying, wow, today was a one, where the other person is saying today was a 10. You want to make sure you're clear on what the expectations are. And then once you're able to identify and lay the groundwork for exactly what you've been looking for, you create a system that allows your team to be successful. Give them parameters. Give them block schedules that tell them, this is the type of procedure I want to do when I first walk in in the morning, or this is what I do not want to do first thing in the morning. I'm not my sharpest. I'm not, you know, aware of what's going to happen. We don't want this type of procedure to potentially throw us off all day long. Everybody has their own reasons and what they constitute as a great day. Just be clear be concise, and then set a system. And you will see continual balanced results. We hope you enjoyed this episode of Dental All-Stars. Visit us online at allstardentalacademy.com.